2023 has come and gone and it's time to reflect on what the year has been and what I plan to do for next year or at least what my goals are. So for 2023, it was a roller coaster of a year to say the least. When the year started, I was working at a supermarket that was in the Dali section and at the time that the year began, I was a few days away from handing out my two-week notice when basically because I felt that I was in a really bad place mentally speaking and I really needed to take a step back in order for me to reassess my life, figure out what am I going to do with my life. And so midway towards January, I got out of that job and I started to go to a therapist and I would go to the therapist to look for that guidance that I needed in my life to figure out how to get things going, get myself in a better place mentally. It actually paid off in many ways, things turned around. Now VR chat was also one of the things that helped me turn things around, believe it or not, because I met a lot of people there and I made a lot of friends along the way. Now, when the year started, I didn't see myself being on VR chat all the time. It just wasn't my plan. It just something that just happened and basically speaking, right now I met I made more friends thanks to it. And another thing about my VR chat journey was my self-discovery. When the year began, I thought that I was straight. Little did I know that I actually wasn't when I made myself discover discovery at first I thought it was bi and now I consider myself to be pan. Another thing was the way I saw myself. The way I saw myself has changed throughout this year alone. And if you've seen my channel profile, you can pretty much get an idea of what that part of the self-discovery was. 2023 was definitely a year for the ages, at least for me. I wouldn't call it my best. It's definitely not my worst, not, not by a long shot. It's the most interesting year that I've had in my life so far. Now, when it comes to the whole YouTube side of things, I've seen an increase in numbers since September when I start to upload and or rather stream NBA 2K and to be honest I really had no idea whether I was gonna stream that or not and so basically my channel's doing better than it has been in a long while and I've been doing YouTube for 10 years now and I see it heading in the right direction to say the least you know I see a future with this now I've talked about 2023 and what it was for me now it's time for me to give my goals for myself for 2024. So my first goal is to get to 200 pounds. Now, throughout my whole life, I struggled with weight loss, and right now I'm sitting about 230. My second goal for 2024 is to start selling uh, channel merch. My third goal is to get to 1,750 subscribers. Now, why that specific number? Mm, I don't know, but I definitely think it's uh, realistic uh, based on where I am my, right now, where my channel is right now. And my final goal for 2024 would be to be more consistent. So it's consistency in all areas of my life. So yeah, that's it for this video. This is not the last video of 2023. Last video will actually be the New Year's Eve stream that we'll be having later on. So make sure to stay tuned for that. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the stream. Peace.